Um, no, definitely a wonderful initiative by uh, Sunfoil to up the prize money. But it's not just the prize money. I think uh, the fact that they see and they place importance on the four-day uh, competition and you know that has a, a, a big effect on our test players, you know, our test arena, and you know, so the guys are look, are looking forward to the to, to the tournament, and you know, hopefully, we as unlimited Titans can hit the ground running Thursday. No, definitely, it's been a season of that. Uh, the unlimited Titans in a one-day format. Uh, you know, we've had a lot of youngsters come through. Um, a few of the senior players have led from the front: Hanekun, Etienne Balati, and Henry Davids, and. Um, the younger players, Graham from Bean and you know, the, uh, Mangalisa, they've taken a leaf out of their books, uh, finished some of some important games for us uh, you know, in pressure situations. Hopefully they can uh, use some of that form uh, coming into the four-day uh, campaign, just tweak their game a little bit to adjust to the to the, <laughs> the, the longer version. We've been playing lots of uh, white ball cricket of late, so you know, it's definitely an opportunity for them to showcase their skills. I think the competition has been tight over the last few years. Last year we were abysmal, you know, to say the least. You know, we, you know, we let our fans down, we let our players down, you know, we let the coaching staff down. You know, um, and the year before that we were champions. So we want to rectify that. Uh, you know, we take a lot of pride from, in our performances, and hopefully last year was the season where, you know, we we took a little bit of a hiding, uh, and uh, and this year, you know, we can rectify that uh, and hopefully push for honours uh, come April.